One of the common challenges we often face as new moms is that setback it can have on our career or a drop in our productivity levels. But what if I told you there are some habits that we can adopt into our day-to-day -day activities that can actually improve our productivity? These habits have you know, personally helped me amidst the demands of taking care of my baby to be able to start a YouTube channel and even post regularly. But before I go on into this habit, if you are new here and you want more information on how to be empowered on your parenting journey, please do well to subscribe to the channel and hit that little bell so you get notified once I post a new video. Part of the demands that comes with having a baby is the increase in chores and daily tasks you know, for the new moms. But one of the habits that has helped me to stay on top of these chores and tasks is leveraging on technology. So leveraging technology helps us multitask. So you can be washing with the washing machine, doing the dishes with the dishwasher, you know, vacuuming with your robotic vacuum cleaner, all at the same time. And you can also at that same time be focusing on something more important to you. So you're doing four tasks at a time. That's what technology can help you do. Save more time, save energy, and save stress. The second habit helps to reduce the amount of time it takes to do a particular task. And that's learning shortcuts, learning acts, or the psychology of how babies behave. So when I mean acts, like for example, I'm a boy mom and no, if you ask like a lot of boy moms, they will tell you that that time when they want to change their boy's diaper, you know, there is a likelihood that you know, your baby can just pee into your face. One of the acts that I've learned to prevent that is to use a wet wipe to, you know, to rub his tummy. And so if he wants to pee at that time, you know, that wet wipe can help stimulate that reflex action of you know, the pee. So I'll just wait for like one minute max and you no know, remove the diaper. And so I don't have that accident occurring most of the time. So it just helps me stick to the exact time I'm supposed to change this diaper. Some of these acts you can also find on my channel here. Learning some of these acts has helped to significantly reduce you know, the time I spend in you know, caring for my baby. The third habit learning to say no. This habit is like one that you, know, you really need to be able to stand your ground and then you know sometimes you don't care what people feel or what people will say because of your decision of not committing to what they wanted to commit to so that's habit number three learning to say no the fourth habit that has helped me save more time as a new mom is practicing self-care so self-care doesn't actually mean spending too much money for example for myself like one of the self-care habits that I have inculcated into my daily activities is as simple as drinking clean table water, cooking with healthy oil, adding electrolytes to your water to you know, help with your electrolyte levels. This can help to reduce dizziness or even feeling of tiredness during the day or even feeling moody. Even taking multivitamins like cod liver oil, you know, this contains like omega-3 fatty acids that can help the brain to function very well. If you're not strong enough, you fall sick. The time that you're supposed to spend focusing on more important things, you actually spend it recuperating. But in the actual sense, you could have done some little self-care activities that I've mentioned earlier that can help you stay on top of your mental and physical health. If you enjoyed this video, and you avoid up to this point don't forget to like comment let me know some simple habit that you have also adopted to your daily life that has helped you increase your productivity or any of the simple habit that you, know, you can relate with just let me know in the comment section and i'll see you in my next video